What's up everybody, my name is Trey and I'm here to bring you yet another Marvel Minute. This week the Marvel Minute is about Ant-Man, which is out in theaters right now and is a damn good movie. Hell yeah it is. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Ant-Man first started as Hank Pym, who discovered the Pym particles, which can make him shrink down to microscopic size or grow to about 100 feet in, in size. Uh, in, that, in those sizes he retains his or in his shrunken size, he retains his pretty much his normal strength, which is pretty much enhanced at that point, and his strength does get enhanced in his larger form. Um, he later creates Ultron, which most people do not know, but he does create Ultron, which creates many, many, many havoc, havoc situations for the Avengers. Um, besides um, that, he's also married, or was married at one point, to Janet Van Dyne, who was the Wasp. Uh, the second Ant-Man was actually Scott Lang, who was actually the one portrayed in the movie. Scott Lang started off as an electronics expert, and when he couldn't make money doing that, he started to go to thievery to make his ends meet. Um, he stole the original Ant-Man suit in an attempt to, to uh, get money to save his daughter's life because she needed a life-altering operation. Um, both Ant-Man have done very well for themselves along with, the, along with the Avengers. Hank Pym does get kicked out of the Avengers, but is reassembled into them. Scott Lang does stay with the Avengers for a very long time under the mantle of Ant-Man. The powers of Ant-Man include, the, like I said before, the ability to shrink down to microscopic size or grow to about 100 feet tall. He retains his strength. Most of the time it is enhanced in, that, in both forms. Uh, in his small form, he can have he has a helmet that allows him to communicate with ants, which he can pretty much control and tell them what to do, and any they'll do anything he asks. Um, in his larger form, he has uh, great strength, and I think he was once known as Goliath in that form, not you know big man or whatever. Uh, Scott Lang has the exact same power sets as um, Hank Pym when it comes to the Ant-Man suit and it is actually taken two more times later down the road by two different people. Uh, one a low-level S.H.I.E.L.D. agent and I can't recall what the other guy was at the first time. So there has been four Ant-Mans. Um, that's about it. Uh, if you guys want to know any more about Ant-Man, go ahead and check him out. You can find a lot of information online about him. That's it for now. Peace.